How's it going guys? Sir Teapot here. Today we are back with more Story of Teapot. And today it is... One second, let me grab this. And then bring it over here. It is the 1st of July. And today... Oh, that's fucking awesome. Is Pikachu! Which is absolutely amazing. And if you didn't know, the 1st of July is actually my birthday. So today I am now 23 years old. Getting old. And if you know the infamous uh, line from, I believe it's Machine Gun Kelly's song, and I believe it's in a Blink-182 song as well, no one link likes you when you're 23 without a plan. And I'll tell you something, I've never had a plan. And I'll tell you something else, I'm never bloody going to have a plan. Because that's the best way to probably live, to be honest, just go with the flow. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get downstairs, and I'm going to get some, well, to be honest, I'm probably just going to order some breakfast this morning. Because not really in a mood for making some food this morning. But later, I will be trying to attempt to cut myself a steak. So hopefully, that doesn't go wrong. So as I said, I was going to come downstairs. <coughs> excuse me. And order some breakfast for me and Kim. And um, it is literally just gone 12 o'clock. So it's come, come literally bang on dinner time, to be honest. And today, I am having a spam and hash brown sandwich. Which, if I can actually lift, you'll be able to see the hash brown under that. There's a couple of hash browns in there. And Kim is having, and Kim has just gone upstairs to sort Evie out because she's just woken up as soon as food arrived, which is brilliant and typical. But Kim is having popcorn chicken with you. I'm not stealing my food. I'm not stealing your foods. I promise I not steal your food. I not steal your foods. <laughs> you can rewatch the clip and see that I not steal your foods. <laughs> um, but yeah, so Evie's upstairs just in a cot at the moment having a bit of a well she just woke up from a nap and then i've just been playing some gta 5 which is a massive rarity i thought i'd jump on and just um, see if i could get my monthly million but it apparently hasn't updated yet that it's the first first of july so can't get my monthly million yet so i'm gonna wait to get that uh, but i did buy the uh, nightclub today uh, so i have been doing some work on the nightclub which is really 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 cool actually i'm really enjoying working on it so far but i'm gonna probably going to be jumping on either COD or Skyrim soon, because like I said yesterday, I do really want to play Skyrim, but I have also been really, really enjoying playing Call of Duty. So, I've now turned GTA off, and the Xbox is off as well, because we are on getting ready to go out. See if he's in her... Wait one second, let me come around here. See if he's in her prom. Yo. <laughs> and we are going out for a little bit of adventure, with it being my birthday and stuff, but Not we're on... Not an adventure, we're going for shop browsing. Yeah. <laughs> adventure. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we're off browsing for, into some shops and stuff like that. And um, might be buying something to finally go into the... Uh, where? Yeah, go. There we go, we can see my hand now. The fish tank's over there. Uh, but I don't know, though. Might be something might, might be something that I might have to look it into today, not actually come home with. Uh, but it'd be quite cool if I could actually get something to actually go in there today. So we're now in um, me, Kim and Eva are all in this local pet shop and we're just looking at um, frogs and geckos and stuff like that and we've seen a crested gecko up there which is really really cool and uh, there's a few frogs up there, um, there's a few like toads and stuff but if you look in here you might not be able to actually, oh he's coming out actually, there he is, just in that little eye hole, eye hole there in the skull is a actual albino Spanish ribbed newt which I believe we actually like the look of. Um, so we might end up having, well, we might end up getting him to be honest because he does look really, really cool. So I'm now on my way home from being in Reptilia, and as you can tell, I'm joined by no one. There's no Kim, no Evie, and that's because they've both already gone home because Evie was getting hungry, so they needed to bob home. But I've got a bunch of stuff here, all from Reptilia, and the reason for all this is because. I've got a new pet coming home with me soon, but I need to go home first to come back out because I need to get all these home. And uh, I'm meeting my stepmom um, at Reptilia to go get my new pet, and you guys shall see it very shortly. So in that last clip, you listed me on my way home, and now I'm already on my way back out because um, I'm heading back to the pet shop to go meet my stepmom, like I said. I don't know if I said that actually, I'm pretty sure I did. Go meet my stepmom so then I can go pick up the um, the pet that I'm getting and what it's living in. It's living in a vivarium. So I'm going to go pick that up. Uh, of course, I can't bring it home because it's literally like pretty hefty. Like, it's pretty wide. So for me to carry it home by myself would be possible. And plus, it's already got, it's already kind of like pre set up a little bit because it's an X display. 
Um, so it's already kind of pre-set up a little bit. So it'd be even heavier to carry it home. So I needed someone with a car. Um, so my stepmom's coming to meet me, like I said, and we're going to be picking it up and then hopefully get it home and get it set up quite quickly because don't want it being out of its home for too long. So I'm now home and everything like that from being back out and I've been with my stepmom and everything like that. Been to the pet shop again, um, but she's taken the vivarium with her because she's gone to pick my dad up quickly uh, with it being my birthday and stuff like that. She's just gone to pick him up and stuff. And as you can tell, the fish tank's gone. And the reason for that is, and the reason I've got no shirt on, because if I come up these stairs, oh God, I've took the fish tank upstairs by me sen. And I'm a little bit exhausted from it. Um, I've moved it to make space for, oh God, it's echoey. The um, vivarium that's coming. And I can now show you, now I'm back downstairs. I can show you the new pet I've got. Because he's currently inside of this. And if you look closely, you might it might be a bit camouflaged at camera. But there is a leopard gecko in there. Not a leopard gecko, a, a crested gecko, sorry. And uh, he's only about four or five months old, but we don't know his actual, um, if he's a boy or a girl yet. So we don't have a proper name for him yet. So if you guys got any suggestions, leave them down below in the comments, because I'll read through them and I'm intrigued to see what ideas you guys come up with. I am thinking just for the time being, just calling it Little G for Little Gecko. <laughs> uh, but we'll see um, what ideas actually come up with. And um, I'm quite excited to see what ideas you guys come up with. So I've now moved Evie's, uh, well not Evie's, the fish tank from there to there into the corner of Evie's room. The reason for that is because in the future I'm hoping to be able to get Evie some fish or something like that to put in a bedroom which I think would be absolutely awesome. I think she'd, it'd, well, it'd just be really cool to have. So that's something I'm definitely going to do in the future but I need to wait until she's a lot older. So, I am now setting up the vivarium for um, the leopard gecko that we still haven't named yet. Crested gecko. Crested gecko. I keep calling it leopard gecko. It's a crested gecko. It's because they said leopard on it, the information sheet that I've got for lighting. It says leopard gecko on it. Uh, but it is looking rather, rather awesome, I think. I think it looks really, really good so far. Um, it probably looks a bit overcrowded to, come to you guys and stuff like that. But um, it is supposed to be quite overcrowded so they can climb around and stuff like that. But Evie and Kim are just over there and Evie She's has... just finished feeding. Yeah, literally all about to fil film Evie feeding and she's already but he devoured it all. Uh, which is, to be honest, pretty good, to be honest. She's eating it pretty quickly. Uh, what did she have today, did you say? Uh, well, broccoli. Broccoli. Uh, something else. Something else. Cheese. And cheese. So... Oh, well, it's sweet potato. No. Oh, I don't know. Then I thought it was sweet potato. But yeah, God knows. But she seems to really like, like it and she's absolutely throwing it all back. But I'm going to crack on with the rest of this, get all lighting set up and get the uh, crested gecko in its vivarium. So the terrarium is now fully set up and I'm just going to close it up because if you look on that little... Oh, wait, wait, if I actually open it back up, you might be able to see him. If you look on there, there is the leopard gecko inside his um, new vivarium and it is looking really really nice in there i think it looks brilliant uh, obviously i need to get this off and give it a quick clean up outside and stuff like that but it is looking really really good in there what i've give a mist to all the plants and stuff like that as well so he's got a drink ready because they like to drip that like get the drink when it drips off of the plants and stuff like that and every single plant in there by the way is live plants so i do need to obviously still take care of them and stuff like that and make sure they get a good water and stuff like that but i've got this bloody big water pump uh, for misting in there and stuff like that so i am well prepared for it all and i've got his food at the ready and i've got some food over there for him so i'm going to give him um, a feed at some point to see if he's actually hungry and uh yeah so also guys i don't know if well no i have said this but just a reminder if you have got any ideas for a name or anything like that do let me know down in the, in the description below not in the description the comments below and i'll definitely read through them because i want to see what ideas you guys come up with so i'm now heading out which again which is a bit of a surprise because i don't normally go out this much and as you can tell by probably how echo it is it is um very very quiet at the moment because it is quite late to be honest it is currently god 20 to 9 at night bloody i didn't realize it was that late uh yeah so it's currently 20 to 9 and i'm just going to meet um some friends 
for a little bit because normally on um well on today we normally meet up and just have a bit of a chill out and a chat for a little bit because my birthday is obviously today and one of my friends birthdays is actually tomorrow weirdly enough um so we, what we do we normally meet up at my birthday have like a bit of a chat and a chill out and stuff um to celebrate both of us birthdays being right next to each other really uh so i'm going to meet her now and uh, she's with I believe with her partner but kim's staying at home obviously because of evie and it's just actually started spitting a little bit uh, so i'm gonna pick up the pace a little bit and get to well so I'm meeting them at, I'm meeting them in, in a park but we should be under shelter a little bit so I'm gonna hurry up and actually get there so I've now finished chilling out with my mates for a bit and everything like that and I'm on my way home now and still it's quite dark all of a sudden <laughs> um, but yeah I've been moving for about an hour or so so it's been pretty decent to be honest we've had a pretty long chill out it's been a while since we've actually seen each other so it's been a pretty good time to be honest so I'm gonna get home and chill out for the rest of the evening and I think I'm gonna I don't know, maybe jump on some Call of Duty, but I might play some Skyrim, not sure yet. So guys, I, it is now, well I am now home, and it is currently 11 o'clock, and I've come home and um, Kim's already taken Evie up to bed, because um, she is extremely tired, I came in as she was literally just taken her upstairs and she was just completely gone, so I didn't get to see her before bed, which is a bit of a shame, but it's <clears throat> not to worry really. But um, Kim's going to be coming downstairs soon, but I am currently joined by... Um, one of, well, not the new pet that I've got because he's currently, well, he or she is currently hiding, but I am joined by my other pet. I am joined by Ken. Hello, Ken. It's a day of pets today, isn't it? So I'm joined by my little boy, Ken, who's been very, like, who's been very boisterous in his cage, throwing him to the bar a bit, so I thought I'd get him out for a little bit. And he's been a little bugger climbing around one second. Oh, come here. There we go, got him back. <laughs> Tried buddy escaping onto me, oh, over me. So yeah, I'm gonna get, let him have a bit of a play on me and let him run around and stuff like that. And then I'm gonna put him back in his cage and then I'm gonna, like I said, probably play some games for a little bit and then head up to bed. So guys, I'm gonna have to be a, a little bit quiet because uh, you might be able to just see inside, just with the tip of my finger, an outline of um, the crested gecko that we've got. So I think we've now got um, a temporary name of Gizmo for the time being until we obviously find out its gender and get a few suggestions. But Kim's just come downstairs as well so she can see see it obviously because we don't know if it's a male or female yet. Yeah, like I said it's already called Gizmo for the time being. Mm, Gizmo, I said, if it's a female it's called Gizzy. Well, we'll see what other people say in comments as well because we might get some good names from other people. So don't forget as well guys, leave some comments below, even though I've said it about three times in this video. Um, so yeah, I don't, obviously you won't be able to see him too well, but obviously this is the best shot I've been able to get so far. So guys, I've just come downstairs to get a glass of water, and um, I've just noticed that Gizmo has come out quite a bit to be honest. Oh, he's doing a move as well, well, he or she is doing a move. See him in a little head movement, one's probably wondering where the voice is coming from to be honest. So it's quite, it seems, well, it seems to be um, enjoying its environment which is awesome. So that is really, really good. Hopefully it uses a lot more, but it is currently using the um, vine wood I believe it's called or something like that. It's like some natural vine stuff that I've put in um, that I got from obviously the pet shop and it seems to really, really like it. And obviously I'll give everything a spritz with water, um, so all the water drippers are still actually on the plants and stuff like that, which is a massive bonus, so he's still getting his drink and everything like that. And from what I can tell as well, he's eating all of his crickets, which is a massive bonus. So I'm going to leave him, well, he leave he or she to its devices, and I'm going to get my glass of water and head up to bed. So guys, I need to actually outro this vlog because I haven't actually done one at all whatsoever for some reason. It was like a perfect spot last night because I even went downstairs like at like 1 o'clock in the morning or something like that to get a glass of water and I recorded a clip of uh, Gizmo. Oh god, I'm yawning. And uh, I could have just literally done the outro then but I just wasn't really thinking and I just literally got the glass of water and went straight to bed. Uh, but I, the reason, well, you may be wondering why I'm actually in bed and why I'm dressed in bed as well. Um, it's because, well, 
You'll find that in tomorrow's video, but I'm not feeling too great today, but don't worry, it's nothing serious, well, nothing too serious really, like, it's just a few problems here and there, but you'll find that in tomorrow's vlog why I'm actually in bed, but I do need to, like I said, actually put an outro on it, so, thank you guys for watching, I hope you did enjoy today's video, if you did, make sure you do leave a like and do subscribe as well, if you do subscribe, that does help massively and we all appreciate it, also if you could share the video as well, that also helps a hell of a lot. Also, down in the description below will be a link to all our um, social medias and stuff like that if you'd like to follow us on any of them. Well, anyway, guys, I hope to see you guys in tomorrow's video at 6pm. And peace.